Hey, how you doing guys? This is Crafty Walrus and I'm here with The Walking Dead by Telltale Games. Uh, I know this game came out a good while ago, so I know most of you have probably seen it, but uh, I recently started watching a Let's Play of it and it's just amazing. It's so good and I don't think anybody should really miss out on the story. If you like Walking Dead at all, you need to do yourself a favor, you need to watch this. It is so good, it's so compelling, it's, it's excellent. So. Uh, hopefully you just stay tuned. I'm going to try and bust through these episodes. Uh, I'll do them in like 15 minute segments, so there's going to be a lot of them. So, but yeah, let's start it up. I'm so excited to play this. Like, The Walking Dead is, is awesome. The show is okay. The comic is really good. Um, but yeah, from what I've seen in this game, it's just it's so amazing. So it turns down a smidgen. I'll try not to talk too much. This is more like a viewing experience than me trying to be stupid and goofy and whatever. So, um, when there's cutscenes and stuff, I'll I'll try and keep quiet. Yeah. So one, a brand new day. All right, yeah. Let's do this. Let's do it. You guys ready? Because I'm ready. I'm so excited. Game series adapts to the choices you make. Something, something. Yeah, so the story changes drastically depending on what, what you choose. And choices you make in the first season carry on in the second season. And it's, it's really cool. You can get drastically different stories and endings and outcomes. It's really cool. If this if this um, series ends up being successful, I might do uh, the Wolf Among Us because I watched those and those were really good too. <laughs> oh shit! This is racist already. Well, I reckon you didn't do it then. Why do you say that? You know, I've driven a bunch of fellas down to this prison. Lord knows how many. Usually it's about now I get the, I didn't do it. And what do you say? I say, yep, I know you didn't. I followed your case a little bit, you being a making boy and all. Making boy. What do you think? I'm just glad I chose law and not order. Big mess of trial like that, even if you was innocent. A lot of what happened can't ever be undone. I got a nephew up at UGA. You teach there long? Going on my sixth year. You meet your wife in Athens? You want to know how I see it? I got much choice? Sure don't. Uh, that piss him off. Regardless, Oops. could be you just married the wrong woman. <sighs> I'm driving this man once. He he was the worst one. He wouldn't stop going on about how he didn't do it. He was an older fellow, big soft eyes behind his hair, folk glasses. He just wailing back there. Says it wasn't him. Crying and snotting all over right where you're sitting. Then before long, he starts kicking the back of the seat like, like a fussy baby on an airplane. Not telling him he's got to stop. But that's government property. 
and I'll be forced to zap him otherwise. So he stops, and having exhausted all his options, he starts crying out for his mama. Mama, it's all a big mistake. It wasn't me. So did he do it? They caught the fucker red-handed, stabbing his wife, cutting her up as the boys came through the door. He sits in my car screaming bloody murder that it wasn't him. I think he actually believed it himself. Oh, shit. It goes to show, people up and go <laughs> mad when they believe their life is over. Uh, well, I got another good that? one for What's you. What's that called? This one's a little bit less depressing uh, and a bit more hilarious. Foreshadowing. Oh, shit, sure, watch out! This watch other out. time... Oh, I almost missed it. No, I'm doing this. I didn't even see that there was an option until it was almost too late. Oh shit. There's like no cars on the highway, so how are there zombies out here already? Oh, walking dead. Oh shit. I'm, I'm still sure. cuffed back here. Dragged from the car. Officer? Oh, that doesn't look good. He wasn't ejected from the car. Why the hell did he have his gun out? Maybe it was tossed from the car during the wreck. He's not moving. He must have the handcuff keys on him. Must have the handcuff keys on him. Yes. Oh. Uh. Uh. Yeah, you get it. I need to drag myself out that window. Yeah, no. I need to drag myself out oh, that what? window. Why not? Oh man, I gotta get that shotgun ASAP. I have a feeling them zombies are gonna be back. Shotgun shell. Oh, I'm gonna need it. I'm gonna need it. Get it. Come on. Man, that's a big gash. The officer's shotgun is over there. Yes, it is. Why would he have needed that? Looks empty. No kidding. He's picked up a shell. Oh my god. It'll be easier to carry with these cuffs off. Alright. I guess I gotta go over to him. Officer? God damn. Officer? Oh. Ooh, nice. Right there. Oh, of course. Of course. Ugh. Get it? Oh. Oh 
Oh, shit. Officer. Oh, get out of here. No! Back up, back up. Jesus Christ. Shotgun. Get Pick away it. from me! Get it, get it, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, no! Get it! Ah! Don't make me do this! Oh. oh! No hesitation. You gotta get out of there, man. They're coming. Man. Help! Go get someone! Little girly, help There's me. There's been a shooting! Oh my gosh. Oh man. Hustle. Hustle. Oh Jesus, get up. Hustle. Oh man. If I saw that, I would be booking it regardless. The outbreak just started. How are there <laughs> like half the cave zombies already? Also, man. Also. Be one hell of a nightmare to go through. Hello, anybody? Oh man, I guess I should go inside. Want to drink a water? Nope, can't go there. I wonder if anybody's home. <laughs> Oops. I wonder if anybody's home. Yes, I wonder that as well. Hello? Anybody home? I need a little help. Let's go for it. Coming in. Don't shoot, okay? Hmm. Man, they're in. Atlanta, and he's a man of color. It's a dangerous situation to be in. Hello? I'm not an intruder. Or one of them. One of them. These people might need more help than I do. Oh my god, unicorns, no. They did this. Really? You saw it there. Uh oh. I have a gash on my leg. Hmm. Marshalls. That's a Savannah area code. Savannah? That's the oh. type of note you'd leave a babysitter. Savannah's the greatest place in the U.S. that I've been to. It's a beautiful place. Bullets? No. How long has this guy been out? Like, <laughs> all these houses have already been looted? Mm, you're in. What's that beeping? I guess they really want me to go check these messages. 
Look your face. Furniture overturned, blood everywhere. Jesus. Jesus. Maybe there's something on there. Three new messages. Message one, left at 5.43 p.m. Hey, Sandra. This is Diana. We're still in Savannah. Uh, Ed had a little incident with some crazy guy near the hotel, so we had to get him back to the ER and have it checked out. Anyway, okay. he's not feeling well enough to drive back tonight, so we're staying an extra day. Thanks so much for looking after Clementine, and I promise we'll be back in time before your spring break. Oh. Message two. Left at 1119. Robot. Oh my god, finally. Perfection. I don't know if you tried to reach us. All, all the calls are getting dropped. They're not letting us leave and aren't telling us anything about Atlanta. Please, please, just leave the city and take Clementine with you back to Murrieta. I've, I've got to get back to the hospital. Please let me know that you're safe. Message three, left at 6.51 a.m. Clementine, baby. If you can hear this, call the police. That's so sad. It's 911. We love you. We love you. We love you. This game is heart wrenching. Is there a zombie in the house? Who is this? I'm Clementine. This is my house. Oh, girl. Hi, Clementine. I'm Lee. You're not my daddy. No, I'm not. Where are your parents? They took a trip and left me with Sandra. They're in Savannah, I think. Where the boats are? Where are you? I'm outside in my treehouse. They can't get in. That's smart. See? Can you see me? I can see you through the window. There she is. Oh, Jesus! Kill, 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 kill! Oh. Oh, oh, man. Thanks. Oh, okay. Get out of here, man. Oh, my God. Yeah, me, woman. Yeah. Oh my God. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Babysitter. Man. Hi there. <laughs> Pretty nonchalant about all that. Did you kill it? I don't know. I think so. Sometimes they come back. Have oh, you killed one? Poor little girl. No. But they get shot a lot. You've been all by yourself through this? Yeah. I want my parents to come home now. I think that might be a little while. You know? Oh. Look, I don't know what happened. But I'll look after you until then. What should we do now? Yeah. We need to find Fun help before daytime. it gets dark. Yeah, it's not safe at night. Let's go. Stay close to me. Let's go, little random girly. Oh, 
What is she? Is she like Asian or white or her parents look black in the picture? I'm so confused. Jeez, slow down. I ain't never getting home to mama at this rate. This sucks. Oh, it's hot dish night. That's <laughs> all he's worried about. Hillbilly's in Atlanta. I don't know, man. Keep your distance. What's the matter? Should I stay? What? I don't want to sleep in the treehouse tonight, but I don't know if I should leave. What if my parents come home? I won't leave you alone. Well, let's go somewhere safe that's close, okay? That's a good idea. Let's see what these hillbillies are doing. Hey, man! Holy shit! Don't eat us! We're not gonna hurt you. Yeah. Thought for a second you and the little one were both gonna give us the chomp. We need help. Are you trying to get out of here? Because you should be. Those things are all over the damn place. I haven't seen anything as gnarly as this neighborhood since downtown Atlanta, 15 miles back. I'm Sean. Sean Green. Lee, this is Clementine. I'm Chet. We shouldn't be out in the open like this. How about you help us clear the way, and we'll take you and your daughter out of here and down to my family's farm. It should be safer there. I'm not a dad. I'm... A neighbor. Her parents are out of town. Uh oh. Let's get going. Staying oh, no. home is a mistake. Hopefully, I didn't lie. What She's do you want to like, do? I. I don't want people to think I'm a liar. The monsters coming. We gotta go. The monsters coming. Leave quick. Let's go. What's that fat kid doing? I have a bum leg. Were any of those guys neighbors too? Huh. Well, I said that. That was like a smart ass remark. Or if he knew I wonder if he knew I was lying. I should have just told him I'm some guy. I feel like that lie is gonna come back and bite me in the ass. All right, I'm gonna stop into that one when we get to the farm. I, I think, I wonder if it's gonna be Herschel's farm, maybe? Anyways, I'll leave it there. Thanks for watching, guys. I'm gonna pick it up right here, so just uh, stay tuned for the next episode. Catch you guys later, bye.